We're going to uh, get started with the demos from the hackathon. We have eight projects here that are going to demonstrate uh, one after another. Uh, you'll have to make a note of these uh, because we will be doing uh, public voting. And then based on that, we will decide the winners of this hackathon. All right? So if you guys don't mind, please move towards the front because some of the things these guys will be showing will be really tiny parts you might not even be able to see from the back. So the further you sit up, the better you will be able to see some of the tiny parts here. All right, I'm going to let you guys get started. Okay, good evening everyone. Uh, so I am Yogesh, working as a junior embedded engineer on IoT products. And I am Surya Sundarraj. I am also an embedded engineer. And uh, here we are uh, on to the smart LPG stand. So before going to the topic, why this is a smart LPG, LPG stand? Okay, uh, we are making a stand which will uh, sense the weight of the gas, LPG gas system. Uh, and it will be also able to uh, sense the leakage of the gas. And uh, the next thing is... In the present scenario, as you are seeing, you want, if you want to book a gas, you want to... I'll just start, the, I'll just start my demo uh, asking, you, asking a question like, uh, I can say every, uh, every person here may face the worst side of the traffic jams here traffic jams right and you you can see the uh, ambulances like uh, sirening on back back of you uh, uh, st uh, waiting for the signal getting cleared like at that time what you will feel like okay if, if there is a if there is any chance to make make the ambulance clear okay people may people may uh, help the, help the person who is in the ambulance right uh, every second matters like if it is getting late so the now, this is like when, when an ambulance is stuck in, uh, stuck in the mi middle of the traffic, what we can do? So our project is like real-time emergency traffic corridor. My name is Rajiv Brahma. And I'm, I'm Arvind. Like, uh, what we going to do uh, in this project? Like, uh, suppose an ambulance is reaching... Uh, 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 um, imagine this scenario. You're at a coffee shop. There are about 50 different coffees. You're trying to think about what to buy and you just can't think about anything. And your friend told you something the other day, you cannot seem to remember that as well. Now the cashier is giving you dirty looks, the people behind you are giving dirty looks, everybody's getting impatient, my heartbeat starts rising. It becomes a huge issue. It's a real world problem, we have a real world solution. So I'm Vaishak and this is Invenio. Invenio uh, is a basic uh, recommendation system. It's an internet of things project based on uh, recommender systems. Um, so what this does is it uh, basically finds your location and depending on your location and past interests, what it's gonna do is it's gonna build recommendations using our uh, custom recommendation engine and interact with real world displays to give you real world suggestions. Right, so the problem with uh, traditional recommendation systems are that they're on your laptop or they're on your phone. They give you good recommendations, but you don't tend to... Re no replay. <laughs> Have a nice dinner, no? Uh, sorry, lunch, no. <laughs> okay, uh, let's come to introduction first. Uh, I'm Raghav Priyan. He's Harish. Uh, he's Nikhil and that guy is Harsha. Uh, we are uh, B pursuers and uh, uh, this, uh, this is... Uh, uh, he, he is a BS, uh, the two in astrophysics. Actually, we don't have uh, any link between what we have done, but uh, we have learned uh, every part of this thing, and uh, uh, we have done with uh, what, uh, what experience we have uh, got from our, uh, big, uh, what we learned. Uh, uh, what the thing we have done today is uh, called uh, SOCOSIS. Uh, it's just a sh uh, short word of uh, what it is called is a uh, social media based uh, control system. Uh, what it does is uh, uh, it just uh, uses the social media. So, I'll begin. Good afternoon, guys. Uh, this is Sonika and myself, Tarun. So, this is our app, Log My Day. It's more than a diary. So, one sec. So coming to journaling and writing diaries, it's more like a habit. 
you know, now at, at this point of time, you have these uh, mobile apps. It's more like digitized, but it's, you know, and things like, you, uh, at this point of time, you have people who generally write. They tend to happen, they tend to use these apps because it is convenient on the fly. And things, li and also you have new customers who are actually coming into this field because it's convenient. Because it's not as hard as going and sticking, being disciplined and sitting and writing. So the point is, you happen to have a set of users, groups, user groups who are actually uh, continuing to do this activity. And these are the chaps whom we are targeting on. And uh, what the existing apps... Uh, I'm Devrat, this is Aparna, and this is Sumit. So uh, show of hands, how many have seen Iron Man 3? Please, show of hands. Okay. So uh, how this project started was that uh, the three of us were watching Iron Man 3 a couple of days ago, and we were coming for the hackathon over here. And uh, we were watching this exact scene, and this is what inspired us. So just ha let's have a short look at it. Okay, so that's really fast fetched. Uh, don't worry, Iron Man's not going to come over here. But what we wanted to do was that implement gesture control, what Tony Stark is trying to do for web. So, uh, you know, there were a lot of options which we tried to figure out. Uh, we thought we could go with uh, Xbox Kinect, you know. Hello everyone, I'm Rajat. So, I'll start with a question. How many of you think what are the greatest inventions by human beings? Any answers? What are the, some of the greatest inventions done by humans? Huh? Not cheese? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, according to me, these are uh, these are the some of the greatest inventions. One is uh, the travel domain, and the other another is the digital age. So the travel lets you uh, go to uh, an information point and gather information, and another lets the information come to you. So th these have really added to the evolution path of human beings. So it's all about information, right? So if information is such a big, you know, game changer in our lives, so already people with power and... The project that we have done here is wholly meant to a particular group of prosthetic people. I mean to say, think of a person who don't have fingers. He can't write something, right? But he wants to write something. In that case, he can go with our project, which I or we call it as invisible pencil. Now let's go for the demonstration. Thank you. 